We know there's been rain all around the valley, different parts, but sad to say the only rain gauge that matters is right here at Sky Harbor. But what is it and why is it here? What the rain gauge is. It's, uh, it's a bucket uh, that the rain will fall into. Yeah, but it's a fancy science bucket. That's it, way off in the distance at Sky Harbor. It's far away from the runway. We could only see it from the top of the parking garage. Up close, it looks like this. It's stuck in with a bunch of other sensors, wind, humidity, visibility. But the silver science bucket is the official measure of rain in Phoenix. I mean, this is only just gonna be for today. And for months, it's been bone dry. Four instances of traces this year, so it came, came close, but just haven't measured. For weeks, we've watched small storms come in and blow right past the airport. You may have gotten rain, but officially, you don't count. So why is this thing at Sky Harbor? We try not to move it around too much and keep it in its same general location, but it's been at uh, Sky Harbor since 1953. Why? Basically because it always was. It was also probably the center of Phoenix back in the day, but now they can't move it. It would mess up decades of weather data. And you can build up a good climate history for one location. Downfalls of a single location is it's not always going to get hit. So it's not necessarily always representative of the whole entire city. The record for a dry spell in Phoenix is 160 days. And unless this bucket fills up soon, we may be on our way to breaking it. William Pitts, 12 News. William, thank you. And what's also